And now, a can't miss moment from the Charlie James Show. Sam, I know we've talked about it a little bit before, but aren't you glad you're not in, on the dating scene? Yes, yes. <laughs> Absolutely glad I over that. I wouldn't, if I were single right now, I would just check into a monastery. <laughs> just, you yeah. know what? I just, uh, just forget. No, nope, I'm not getting out there and messing with all that. I'm going to be become a monk. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> so I've already got kind of the halfway the haircut, right? All I got to yeah. do is have a little band going around there. Yeah. Um, but when you were a single fella, yes, way sir. back in the day, uh-huh. did you get a lot of attention from the ladies? I mean, I'm not trying to brag, but... <laughs> yeah, but here it comes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You did all right? Yeah, did I did all okay. right with the ladies? Yeah, See, I, I never did. I never did get a lot of attention. I don't know what it was. I think it was my personality. Um, but uh, but some guys just have better luck with the ladies than others. Right. And were you a bad boy? I uh, guess you could say that, yeah. Ah, uh, see, that's <laughs> it. Tim was a bad boy. I have, and, I have reverted, though. I am not that way anymore. The ladies love the <laughs> bad boys for some reason, but they do. They love the bad boys. And there has never been more evidence of that than with murderers. You heard me right. Murderers. Alec Murdoch is in prison for murdering his wife and his son. He is a convicted murderer. And he's getting love letters in jail. Tim, I'm not even joking about it. <laughs> um, I don't really women, know the appeal for, for murderers, but... <laughs> women are writing him and sending him love letters. Yeah. And love emails. Maybe, I don't know, maybe it's just the thrill? I don't I don't know what it is. I have no idea. Nicolette, I, I, they, they listed a whole bunch of these um, love letters that he's getting. Nicolette says, I think I love you. I think about you all day, every day. I swear on my life and on my soul, I'll never say a single word to anyone important or not important. I genuinely care for you. And to clarify that, I mean, I won't say anything if you decide to respond. I hope you're doing okay, she said. This is unbel- love letters in jail. Maybe, a murderer. Maybe it's uh, the idea that they may think that they could change this person. The Florence Nightingale syndrome. Yeah. That's what it is. Florence, I'm going to come. I, oh, yes, he killed his wife and son, but I'm the one. I'm the one that can bring out the true man. 32 messages were obtained under the Freedom of Information Act request, appear to be from women reaching out to offer legal advice, extend friendship, and even express love for Alec Murdoch. The messages say they're from all across the country, even as far away as Scotland. I think I love you, one woman wrote, like I said. I think about you all day, every day. Some offer to send pictures. Some are signed with X's and O's. <laughs> so wow. now, if you're a single guy and you don't have a date on Friday night, this has got to make you feel even worse, right? That there are convicted murderers <laughs> out there and that women profess their love for them. Does that make you feel better or worse as a single guy alone on the weekend? I think it makes me feel worse. Yeah, <laughs> um, but me I real. mean, to be honest, I mean, not all women are like that. I didn't say, no, I did not and, say all women. And uh, uh, women that, usually women that are like that, uh, you you don't want to go out with anyone. Are not the women that you want to be in a relationship <laughs> with, all right? So, so if it makes you feel bad, yeah. just, just take that to heart. Yeah. <laughs> don't miss the Charlie James Show, weekdays 3 to 7 on News Talk 98.9. W-O-R-D. The voice of the Carolinas.